23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. Good evening and thanks for joining us for this 23 ABC News digital update. I'm Bayan Wang. Thousands of National Guardsmen are on their way to Washington, D.C. in the wake of the violent riots that took place last week. Guardsmen are coming from as far as New Jersey and expected to help out security around the Capitol through President-elect Biden's inauguration. Other safety measures are in place in D.C., including seven-foot-high fences around the Capitol building, as well as a citywide curfew from 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. every night. And a boy is dead, and a man is fighting for his life after the motorcycle they were traveling on collided with an SUV in northwest Bakersfield Sunday afternoon. According to the Bakersfield Police Department, the collision occurred near Coffee and Hangman Road shortly before 1 p.m. Officers located both victims lying on the roadway suffering from major injuries. The minor died on scene and the man was transported to Kern Medical with life-threatening injuries. The driver of the SUV made a left turn in front of the motorcycle traveling westbound when the collision occurred. BPD confirms police are investigating whether speed or alcohol played a factor in the incident. Anyone with information is asked to call BPD at 661-327-7111. And we can expect that dense fog advisory again for much of the San Joaquin Valley later tonight into tomorrow morning around 11 a.m. Now with this is because of a high pressure system building through next week, creating that fog and low clouds throughout the county. Now temperatures are expected to warm up because of the system as well. So we will see those dry, unseasonably mild afternoon highs. We could even see those 70s later in the week. The coolest temperatures will be on Monday, 61 degrees. We'll see those mid 60s from Tuesday to Wednesday, then we're going to rise into those high 60, 67 on Thursday and 69 degrees on Friday. But over in the mountain communities, we will see those 70s, 75 by Thursday in the Kern River Valley and on Friday. Over in Tehachapi tomorrow, we will see 54 degrees, rising into the 60s later in the week and 55 degrees over in Fraser Park tomorrow, but we will rise into the 60s later in the week as well. For now, that's all I have. Back to you, Bob. All right, thanks, Kylie. For your top news and weather headlines, you can head to our website, turnin23.com. Take care.